So there's been a nuclear attack. Don't ask me how or why, just know that the big one has hit, okay? So what do we do? There's no specific threat. There's no overarching reason uh, why this is the time we sent this out. Um, it's just one tool in the toolbox to be prepared in the 21st century for emergencies. This is uh, a scenario that people do not feel very confident or uh, prepared for. And so, you know, we wanted to meet that need. Step one, get inside fast. You, your friends, your family, get inside. And no, staying in the car is not an option. You need to get into a building and move away from the windows. The world is not getting less complicated. I don't know if there's ever the perfect moment to talk about nuclear preparedness, but this is not directly tied to anything happening in Russia or any other part of the world. You know, TV, the movies can take a lot of liberties. And, um, you know, we don't know. Uh, first of all, again, we By the way, she's lying when she says that this video has everything to do with what's going on in the world right now and how imminent a nuclear attack is. Why in the hell would they even release this in the first place? So let this play. Don't uh, expect this to happen, um, but you know we we don't know what um, anything would look like, and so uh, you know people people need those tools. I think for some people, um, you know, it's it's scary, and we understand that. But um, you know, other people have thanked us that we are approaching this topic that really you never want to have to talk or think about. All praises goes to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bashem and Karkwadash. Double honors goes into the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that taught me the truth. And much love and peace and blessings goes out to all you hopeful elect brothers teaching the word of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. So I'm going to do this quick lesson on the prophecies are manifesting. Prophecies being the words of the scriptures, of course, uh, which are spoken in ancient times pertaining to times that and events that we are living in now. You know what I'm saying? And one of those events, the most prominent one that we go into is nuclear missiles. They start with the apostles and elders, the Israelites that have been on the highways and byways, which many Christians and all kind of politically correct people have been calling us crazy because the world at large, they don't believe in the scriptures. They're, they're more and more uh, have diverged into wickedness. But yet and still the same the same people you call crazy, the same people you believe have a crazy doctrine and this and that. What we're seeing is, is becoming more true and true every day. One of them being these nuclear missiles, man. And this is evident. You know why the Most High is having this come out? Because the whole world can't escape his words. They can deny it all day. But hey, the Most High works on the spirit of these leaders to, you know, do certain things and make make these things happen because the spirit of the Lord is working. You know, so hey, <laughs> surely and truly, America's gonna be destroyed by thermonuclear missiles, man. And this, I mean, you can take it for 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 what it is. Look at it like this, and you know, if a fool would say, "Oh, this doesn't mean anything. This is just a emergency response," and blah blah blah. But through the spirit, you're spiritual. You got your spiritual goggles on. You see why when you go on YouTube or. You know what people are talking about why this is the topic of of conversation why you know new york city is putting out emergency preparedness videos like this is because they know and because we're in this time you know so let's go to jeremiah 50 50 and 13 it says because of the wrath of the lord it shall not be inhabited what is that talking about babylon because as we read on it's going to get into it but it shall be wholly desolate. Everyone that goeth by Babylon shall be astonished and shall hiss at all her plagues. See? And what's going to make Babylon, a.k.a. America, wholly desolate? Thermonuclear missiles. All right? It says, put yourselves in array against Babylon round about. All ye that bend the bow, shoot at her. Spare no arrows, for she hath sinned against the Lord. See? 
And how is Babylon sinned against the Lord? How is it sinned against Yahweh for uh, capturing his people, for oppressing the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans who are the true princes of power? So for that reason, hey, everything America has done is coming full circle. And this is the way Yahweh Basham Shai has chosen to end the story of America, you know, because Babylon itself goes back to that term Babal, which means confusion. You know, and that's a nomen omen for the type of spirit that that uh, is pushed in America. The type of spirit that people are in, they're, they're in a spirit of confusion. And that's why the Most High uh, had it go by this moniker, you know what I'm saying, from the ancient times. Of course, you know, in modern terminology, America has the name America, but the Bible is a mystery. So that's why the Lord calls America by a code name in his standard. Because, yes, could the Most High have literally called America out by name? You know, put some Hebrew letters together like Ah, Ma, Ra, uh, Ka, and another Ah. Yeah, he could have did that, but he didn't because this is a mystery and it's only readily available and obvious to the wise. You know what I'm saying? You got to put the pieces together. It says, shout against her round about. She hath given her hand, her foundations are fallen, her walls are thrown down, for it is the vengeance of the Lord. And when walls are thrown down, in the ancient world, that represents a city being taken, a city being destroyed, because walls are the protection of a city. You know, so once the walls fall, hey, what's ever inside, it perishes. And that's what's going to happen to America. Because, the, the, yeah, how about Shemel Shai? He's dissatisfied. With the, the actions of these people Because hey Not only do they uh, Come against the people of the Most High These people in America They Despise Yahweh Bashem Yahweh And all their actions And what they do The women completely out of order You know You got our people You got people rob, robbing Killing each other every day Robbing and killing you know, committing fornication and adultery, worshiping idols, worshiping uh, uh, false religions. So this place got to go. This is Revelation 18 uh, and 8. It says, therefore shall her plagues come in one day, death and mourning and famine, and she shall be utterly burnt with fire. For strong is the Lord God who judgeth her. You see? Being utterly burnt with fire. That is the fate of America, man. The plagues are coming. It says, uh, And the kings of the earth who have committed fornication, right? Because America went, has went throughout the earth with its foreign policies, with, you know, their different agencies in the United States military and their, you know, television and different ways they seduce countries into following after their own ways. Right. It says and the kings of the earth who have committed fornication. That's what the fornication represents. So when you fornicate, that's when you lie in bed. And that's why they got this term terminology when they, you know, use, uh, for example, the governments and when governments collude, they use the term being in bed with like they'll say America is in bed with this place or this place is in bed with this place. Right. And what do you do in the bedroom? You have sex and another the lewd form of having sex is a fornication. And that's what America has done with the with the nations, man. It says, and live deliciously, dis deliciously with her, shall bewail her and lament for her when they shall see the smoke of her burning. You know what I'm saying? And you got to think about this, too. You got countries with that that don't really, if this happened, uh, all the kings of the earth wouldn't mourn like this. But America is really... Uh, beloved in a certain sense and has been for uh, decades, a few a few generations, because that's why all these countries modeled their 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 modeled their uh, societies after America. You know, and and America is starting to be despised on a certain level. But the main thing they're going to miss about America is, is that that money, you know, the prosperity, you know. So, hey, going back to that video, this prophecy is manifesting. So all praise goes to Yahweh Shemuel Shai. Shalom.